people's focus will be on Neymar, it's so bad. Brazil, they didn't go through. Brazil, Argentina, we could have had a Brazil, Argentina, man. What did this do for Neymar's legacy? Oh my gosh, my gosh, Neymar, he was so close. What, what has this done? That's what everyone will, will, will say. But no one is talking about Croatia. And <laughs> incredible character, incredible resolve. Because let's be real, when Neymar scored that goal in first half extra time, nobody thought Croatia were going to come back. People thought it was over. Is it going to be 2 0 or end 1 0? No one, based on how the game was going, I think Croatia had like only one shot on target or something like that. Based on how the game was going, no one thought for a second Croatia were, 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 were going to do anything. No one thought. Um, and when your boy, um, I think it was I think it was Petkovic, when your boy Petkovic scored that goal, and also shout out to your boy um, Juranovic, who might have been man of the match. Like Juranovic on that um, right back was amazing. When that, and I think it was Petkovic. Correct me if I'm wrong. Sorry if I'm wrong. But I think it was, it was Petkovic who scored the, the goal. When he scored that, I was like, excuse me? And you see, everybody was looking at Brazil, Brazil, Argentina, Brazil, Argentina. And everybody was watching the Brazil, Argentina semifinal. But Croatia, they were like, no, you still have to beat us. <laughs> you can't look beyond us. You still have to beat us. And the beauty of the World Cup is... It doesn't care about your name, Mars. It doesn't care about your big names. It doesn't give a damn about, about your narratives. It's about the game. People say, well, Croatia's attack, how good is the attack? They, they, they don't really have a Manzukic. They don't have more shots on targets. No. It's about the game. Croatia, they get it done. And the mental fortitude, the character that Croatia showed was crazy. I put out something on my Twitter. Ivica, good friend of mine, former work colleague. You know, we still keep in touch. He's a good friend of mine. And before the game, I said, "Yo, Ivica, um, do you think you are you ready for? Are you, are you ready to beat Brazil?" And he said, "One hundred percent." I was like, "Whoa!" I, maybe you'll say, oh, "Yeah, yeah, sure. We know we'll, we'll give a everything." But he said, "One hundred percent." So he had real belief that, "Yeah, we can beat Brazil." And you can blame Marquinhos. You can blame Rodrigo. You can blame Neymar not having a very good game and being shot down. And only had that one magical moment. You can blame Richarlison by being incarcerated by Vardiol, the best defender of this tournament so far, and Lovren. You can say all these things. But maybe Croatia were just the better team. Because this is about winning. It's not about shots on targets. It's not about dribbles completed. It's not about passing triangles. It's about who comes out on top when all is said and done. Whether through 90, 120, or penalties, who comes out on top? And Croatia have shown that. Don't take us into deep waters. Because <laughs> if we go into deep waters, we win. Like, the longer the game goes, the more of a marathon it is, the more it's about that's really resolve. Croatia have shown that you don't have our kind of... Like, Brazil, I'm sorry, you don't have our resolve. Maybe he does. Ronaldo, maybe he does, but you don't have a kind of resolve. We're different. So as much as, because it's because I've I've been sitting in silence for I've just been sitting in silence thinking, trying to stay off social media. So as angry and as annoyed I am that I didn't get Brazil interested because I so wanted it, and as and I'm and I was angry and I'm pained as I am. I'm a football analyst, and this is my job. And my job is to analyze football. My, my, my job is not to push my, my agenda. My agenda is for my private life. My job, how I live, this is my job right now, is to be analyze football. Croatia deserve to win. They deserve to win. Because they, won't, they will not go down without a fight. They, won't, they will not go down without a fight. They will always believe. Even in that World Cup final, they, 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 they kept coming back at France, a superior amazing France. So for Brazil, you can be like, it's a disappointment and so forth. But is it a disappointment? Or are these just a bunch of babies who don't have the kind of character or the big boy nature that this experienced creation side have? 
Talent alone doesn't win you a World Cup. Talent mixed with character, mentality, and personality is what wins you a World Cup. Hit the subscribe button over there, guys. I'll see you guys tonight over here for the live World Cup review show.